Hey guys. Alright. Today we're going to add a bolt probe, this, to our bolt, this. So, um, let me get everything set up here and um, we'll get started. So, um, let's remove the magnet. And there we go. Now then, let's align this thing. So let's see if we can fit it into here. trying to get this aligned and um, seeing if I could get it on here Too much. I like it. So let's see if we can tighten this up. go. I believe we got it. So, let's see here. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now then, we're going to insert the drill in here Alright, so I think we're getting everything squared away. And uh, let me see here. Let me I'll look up that um, the size of the drill bit is a 109, I believe. And that is standard fractional size. So the magnet obviously is is uh, let me look real quick, and I can tell you the drill bit size is a 764, which is 109 thousandths in diameter and coincides with the magnet. So, needless to say, that's what size hole we're going to be putting in there or extending the hole that's already in there. So, um, let's get started and see if we can't get this thing drilled out. And um, get it lined out. There we go. Let's tighten it up there. I 
and let's see if this thing will work. And uh, I'm going to kick it on and start drilling and um, see how everything looks. Make sure it's all lined up the best that I can and let's kick it on. There is the bottom of the magnet. I'm going to go a little bit deeper. And this straight into it with the drill bit. Now, the bolt probe I made a little bit big and I'll scuff it up and make sure it'll fit in there. And usually I, I probably go about maybe a quarter inch deep after I get to the bottom of the hole. So, you know, it's it's got the hole in it from the magnet and then I go a quarter inch deeper than that, basically. Because usually I have to cut the uh, end of the bolt off to get the dimensions right to, to make everything come out I'll, I'll show you that boom and there it is so uh, let me pull that out let me shut it off see if I can get this thing out of here and there it is so let's check out the bolt probe okay it's a little bit tight that's good oh yeah okay I don't want to stick it in there too much until I'm getting ready to put that thing in so like I said I usually uh, you know maybe scuff it up uh, use super glue on it oh there we go All right. and um, and I usually cut off about maybe an eighth inch maybe a little bit more to where it sits probably just like that right there maybe so you know so I make it plenty deep enough to where I can move it down so alright so we got it drilled out so uh, let's, uh, I'll get a uh, barrel support and go from there. Okay guys, right here is the bolt and right here is the support. So the way these go together is, let me see if I can do this on camera, is just like that. So you'll see back here where it touches, right there where my thumb's at and that's your measurement point so that's that's where you know that it's that's the right location and then you're looking through this hole right there to find out how far you need to go so um, I like put it up against here the best that I can and and kind of look at it now I've already measured this out and basically right there is where I need to cut it I believe and um, that'll make everything uh, come out right. Where the idea here is, is to have our little probe sitting about like that, I believe. Because right there is where the barrel is going to go in. So this is obviously out of the gun and then been disassembled. So, And it's, it needs to sit just like that, which means, if I can get this all straightened out, it needs to be cut off right in front of that little bitty hole right there on the bolt probe that little tiny hole you see it looks like it needs to be cut right in front of that to be the right depth so let me do that real quick all right and I got it so um, it was a little bit kind of tricky um, 
you know, you really need to have extra, you know, if you're going to do this stuff, uh, you know, because you might mess up. I mean, you know, um, now this right here, you kind of got to, you can fudge it and, and maybe if you go too much, you can, you can ease it out and super glue it in and, and, and make it work. But, uh, let's stick in the bolt probe and see, uh, there we go. All right. So, and I'll come back and, and super glue that end where it, I'll make sure it don't come out. And like I said, uh, right there's a little hole. And see, that's right there is our alignment. So I, I took a little bit more off than I really intended. But, you know, that's it is what it is. So there it is. And uh, and that looks good. I mean, you know, that, that's that's pretty close. So obviously, you know, it... It goes together uh, like this and it slides in there and there it is so then you got the bolt probe sticking out and uh, depending on where you want your pellet location you could trim that so um, all, right. all right and that's how that's done guys all right thanks a lot